All right, we're at Windy City Pulp and Paper Con 2012, and now we're interviewing pulp author and artist extraordinaire, Wayne Reinigal. And Wayne, um, how you doing today? Very good. All right, well, we got a few questions for you here from the, from the fans and the readers out there. Um, number one, what inspires you and what creative things are you enjoying now? Um, I like movies. I, I enjoy the comic book movies. I enjoy just about every kind of movie put out. Uh, I watch all kinds of videos. Uh, read just about everything I can get my hands on. And a little bit of everything inspires me as I do my writing. Um, I watch World War II videos, things like that. Um, what is your favorite pulp story of all time? I always enjoyed the Doc Savage series just because I happened to read it at a time when, uh, you know, 13, 14 years old and I was influenced by it. Um, I grew up reading the classics before that, so I've got a lot of favorites. Okay. Um, what have you done and why should readers look for it? Well, I've written a series called The Pulp Heroes. I've got More Than, uh, More Than Mortal, which is the first book done. I finished Con Dynasty, which was the second one, and I'm currently about halfway through the third book, which will be the final book in the trilogy, and it's called Sanctuary Falls. I write and illustrate them and paint the covers, and the book I put out last year is a new series. It's called Modern Marvels, and the first book is called Victoriana, and next year I'll be working on Gothica, and I also have several short stories. What's a typical writing session like for you? Well, I uh, try to get up early in the morning and start working on it. I'll try and put in about four or five hours. Uh, typically, I'm a slow writer. I can do a page or two every hour. So I get a chapter done a day, and then I tend to proofread it before I turn off the computer. I start the next morning by proofreading it again and kind of cleaning up some last minute and that inspires me to get started on the next chapter. Uh, what were your main influences as a writer? Um, Jules Verne, Mary Shelley, uh, a lot of the classics, H.G. Uh, Wells, Conan Doyle, and that's why I brought them back as the characters that they wrote about when I wrote Modern Marvels. I wanted to uh, do a homage to the writers that influenced me as a kid. And tell us about the next project we'll be seeing from you. The next project is Sanctuary Falls, and it is the third book in the Pulp Heroes trilogy. It occurs in 1949 and kind of wraps up uh, what happens to our Pulp Heroes, explains where they went because the Pulp stopped being published in 1949, and kind of gives us a finale to all the characters. And right after that, I'll be working on Gothica, which is the second of the Modern Marvel series. All right. Thanks very much, Wayne. We'll be looking for your stuff uh, when it comes out. And everything you've done so far has been awesome. So appreciate you taking the time to talk to us. Thank you very much. Bye from Windy City 2012. <laughs>